to Psalm 34. I will extol the Lord at all times. His praise will always be on my lips. My soul will boast in the Lord. Let the afflicted hear and rejoice. Glorify the Lord with me. Let us exalt his name together. I sought the Lord and he answered me. He delivered me from all my fears. Those who look to him are radiant. Their faces are never covered with shame. The poor man called and the Lord heard him. He saved him out of all his troubles. The angel of the Lord encamps around those who fear him and he delivers them. Taste and see that the Lord is good. Blessed is the man who takes refuge in him. Fear the Lord, you saints, for those who fear him lack nothing. The lions may grow weak and hungry, but those who seek the Lord lack no good thing. Come, my children, listen to me. I will teach you the fear of the Lord. Whoever of you loves life and desires to see many good days, keep your tongue from evil and your lips from speaking lies. Turn from evil and do good. Seek peace and pursue it. The eyes of the Lord are on the righteous. His ears are attentive to their cry. The face of the Lord is against those who do evil, to cut off the memory of them from the earth. The righteous cry out, and the Lord hears them. He delivers them from all their troubles. The Lord is close to the brokenhearted, I believe that, and saves those who are crushed in spirit. A righteous man may have many troubles, but the Lord delivers him from them all. He protects all his bones. Not one of them will be broken. Evil will slay the wicked. The foes of the righteous will be condemned. The Lord redeems his servants. No one will be condemned who takes refuge in him. And I love verse 8. Taste and see that the Lord is good. Blessed is the man who takes refuge in him. And taste like food, but also just like almost trying. Just like try the Lord. Try him out and just see that he is good. And we can just run to him for refuge. Isn't that comforting? And also verse 19, a righteous man may have many troubles, but the Lord delivers him from them all. He is going to deliver you. That's not saying you're never going to have any problems, but he is going to be with you in those trials and he is going to deliver us. So I hope these words encourage you today and we'll see you guys back here again tomorrow. And I would like to answer any question you may have about faith in Jesus. Just email me through my website, nancyjoytoyou.com.